Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Wanda. Happy Thursday to everyone. I hope everybody's having a great day. It's snowy, cold, freezing rain here in New Hampshire. So I'm sitting here burning candles and trying to get some listing done on my Macari and Poshmark websites. Gotta get it going. I'm so sick of looking at this stuff, let me tell you. But we have a comings and goings video for the both of you today. I did, uh, I do have three candles as a post burn candle review, as well as I did get a um, small order from Bath and Body Works. I did find a few 75% off things. So I'm actually done with that sale. Um, not doing Goose Creek. I just have too many, but I'll tell you what is happening. Guys, check out Yankee Candle website. I know, it, you know, it, they're not everybody's favorite, but I'll tell you, they're coming back and they're coming back with a vengeance. I've been burning a bunch of their candles lately and I've been very, very happy with them. And they're having a sale. Not only are they having a clearance sale, but they're having an additional 15% off for a fragrance fan, people, whatever. So, they're large jars. Now, if you're interested in large jars, get the two wicks. Don't get the single wicks. The two wicks burn great. Um, they're regular $31. They're on sale for $13.20, an additional 15% off that. Not too shabby. But we're going to do the post burn candle review for you. I have three. And speaking of Yankee, this one came from my vault. And this is not other than Cherry Snowball Cookie. This is three years old. These are 18 ounce candles. And I picked up a bunch of them to place my order. 10 bucks a piece. 18 ounce candle. This is what it looks like, folks. Inside. Do you see soot? Mm -mm. No soot. The wicks did not travel. Um, I had no problems with it pulling out. I did not have trouble with... Um, Wick studding out. Again, no soot. And I don't know if you can see the, the jar. But you can see through the jar. And they had a lot of cutouts on that. So it was beautiful luminary. You had clear parts. You had white parts. And you had gold parts. And it all gave such a wonderful glow when it was um, lit. Loved it. I don't have the scent notes because this was a three-year-old candle. And, but I would give this scent equivalent to Goose Creek's Pink Sugar Cookie. Oh, it smells so good. Or Cherry Vanilla Almond. You know that Jergens Lotion, the Cherry Almond Vanilla. You definitely got the cherry. You picked that up really, really nicely. But you picked up some coconut, some vanilla, a little powdered sugar, and a cookie. Not a sugar cookie, but a bakery butter type cookie. The throat on this was a seven and a half to an eight. It filled up the space that you're in. No problems with it traveling a little bit to the next room. It was tr truly a wonderful, perfect, sweet bakery type scent without being so sweet that it would choke you out. It was just wonderful. And when I repurchase this again, yeah, I could if I could find it. But at that point, I was transitioning from Yankee to Bath and Body Works. So I'm going to end up picking up the one. But if I could, would I have more of these? Yes, I would. The next one, the next two are, I've done them before, went through them. And I did them again. And one was none other than Tipsy Elf. I had to um, light this other one up to finish with the spicy eggnog from Homeworks. And we all know the scent notes on this are Merry Vanilla, Jolly Nutmeg, a sneaky, I love that part, a sneaky elf with a um, cherry splash of rum with natural essential oils. The packaging was so cute. You know what got me on this? The little elf's legs. I said this before. This one was in a really clean burn as well. Did not have any problems with it pulling out the wax. I didn't have any problems with the wick studding out. The wick stayed at a low, possibly up to a medium, but usually they stayed around low. 
And I would definitely give this throw a medium, a 7 out of 10. It did fill up the space that you were in. It didn't travel too much but to other rooms, but at least it filled up the space that you were in, which again, I burn in my home office. I When I had this in the living room to finish off the uh, homework spiced eggnog, I needed both of those going since it is an open concept area. So I definitely needed that going just to fill up that space. Um, I, when I said when I did the post burn on that on the Tipsy Elf, would I repurchase this again? Yeah, because I did have two backups. This is the second one. I have one more, which I'm definitely saving for next year. And then, of course, the fan favorite. I go through three or four of these a year. Pumpkin pecan waffles. And this is what Kate's collection from a couple of years ago. Mm. Another really great burn. Did not soot. Did not um, have any problems with the wick studding out, pulling out. Super clean burn. Yeah, there's some wax stuck to the sides. That's because it cools off so quick and it just sticks. We all know this is a powerhouse. This will knock you to your feet. You could fill, it will fill up your space that you're in. It will fill up the house. It lingers after. You can smell it on your cold clothes. It's absolutely great. After I burn this for a while and get in the car, go to the truck with Mr. Drama King. He's like, <laughs> we get on. <laughs> but yeah, this thing is a power powerhouse absolutely love it and as i said i go through three to four of these a year at least but we do have like i said now that's done with the post burn reviews the incoming oh i stuck with 75 percent off and i just got a couple little things through bath and body works i'm done with them we all know I got the body care and some candles and whatnot from my best friend Barb giving me a Christmas gift certificate. But I do use their car fragrance. And I don't like to spend hardly anything on them because they don't last long, a couple weeks if that. And you're throwing them out. So if these were $1.12. And I got two more in the Midnight Snow. And I got another one in Tiki Beach. Save it for the spring and the summer. And then a strawberry snowflakes. It means strawberry. The warm weather, I'll put that in the car as well. The dollar eighty-seven thing was a wildfall pug refill. The fa -la 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 latte. We've already been through two of the candles. Uh, so I really needed a um that. We'll just save it. And I got two of the single wicks at 75% off. I know I had to pay for the shipping, but my store never had any. And these were the only two I was really interested in because I do like to burn the um, single wicks or the wax melts in my bedroom because most of the time when I'm in the bedroom, I'm watching a movie or what have you, and sometimes the three wick is a little too much. And a single wick is perfect, even though we know some of these single wicks are powerhouse. But, you know, I'll put a, or I'll put a couple of the wax melts in my um, melter pot on the timer. If I fall asleep, it goes off. So I did end up picking up peppermint sugar cookie. And I love the I love this jar. Oh my. It is so darn pretty. You know, it's got that raised texture design. But look at that. Twas the night before Christmas. With the little it's nice geometric, like even though it's um an ornament design, if you're not really thinking that was, I mean look how pretty that is. You just turn it. And that pretty dark blue wax. So pretty. So, there was my coming and going haul. <sighs> so, I will um, hopefully get through a few more candles this week. Trying to get through. Mr. Drama King is off starting Sunday. So, I still have a couple days to see what I can get through. But, you know what? Juicy, you know, look at the Yankee website. With Bath & Body Works increasing their prices, it seems like every day now. What are the, um, it's crazy. You know, it, it makes perfect sense to either look into other candle companies, 
or maybe revisit them and see if there's something that you could find because believe me there's so many alternatives out there for great candles everybody every company has good candles and every company has bad candles so I'm not kicking anybody up or down but there you know there's good and bad and everything so sometimes if you're looking for something different it doesn't hurt looking around and shopping around so there you have it folks with my video i hope everybody has a great rest of your day please like subscribe and hit that notification bell so when i do upload a video you're notified so again thanks again have a great day and i'll see you soon